regular meeting of the Newbury Library Board of Trustees. So we'll do the roll call. Terry Hooters. Melissa Mashburn. Alexander Burke. Dick Masseri. Katie Hart. Okay, let's get started. Approval of the minutes from our last meeting, which was... September 10th. September 10th. Oh, yeah, it's at the very good time. Sure. Okay. Has everybody had a chance to take a look at them? Um, I love reading outs. Yeah. I know, they're, they're so, so beautifully written. Beautiful. Prepare for changes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Is there any uh, updates, changes, modifications, adjustments? Looks frankly, great job, Alex. Yeah. If I have a is there a, a motion uh, to approve? I move that we approve these minutes. Seconded. Second. Motion made and seconded. All in favor? Say aye. 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 Okay. Next on the agenda is the director's report. Sure. Um, so, as you guys have seen, the lab which has been planted by that tree has been planted um, by the Newberry Garden Club in uh, memorial of Cheryl McCarthy. Um, they were going to do some sort of dedication ceremony in May um, once we have an actual data to let you know. Okay. Um, next week we'll be fully stacked. Yay! <laughs> so, um, Lo is here. Uh, she's our um, uh, services part time. Uh, she's in here today. She's amazing. Uh, she actually worked in Georgetown. Uh, after me, uh, so came heavily suggested and loved, and she's been incredible so far. Um, Nikki and I have had with her. And then um, we uh, next Wednesday, Brady Elliott is going to be starting as our circ position part time. Mm -hmm. um, we did a interview with him, and he's great, and we're really excited for him to start. Mm -hmm. um, so, as of all of our current positions, we will be full next week, and as long as no one leaves me. It'll be great. <laughs> um, on top of that, I met with the HR board last week, two weeks ago, um, and uh, got a substitute library position all categorized and it's all set. Um, so probably in November I'll be posting that. Um, and I know that we have a previous employee who's interested in potentially doing some setting. So um, I have that. It says draft, but that's because I don't have the official version. Mm -hmm. That's what it's saying, and I'll grab that. Um, but so, when would you utilize this person? Yeah, so the sub position, it's for, we're a very small staff, so right. if someone's on vacation and all of a sudden someone else is sick, we're pretty much not mm -hmm. well, able to open. <laughs> um, right. So, this person can step in for that. It's great for Saturday usage. Um, mm -hmm. When there's something big happening at the library, like it would be lovely to have someone for Harvest Fest, mm -hmm. just an extra bodies. Um, a lot of libraries use subs, yep. and it is a game changer. Yep. So, yep. yeah, we're very. So, would this be something you'd approach? Uh, Biblio attempts to. No. No, no, it's just like throwing out the call for library subs. Um, it's supposed to be in a pool of like four or five of them. Okay. Um, Georgetown had a couple, like, Libraries usually have a few on staff. Honestly, I'm just looking for one at this point. Um, just have as a randomly as needed. Mm. Yeah. So, so my daughter does that. In yeah. Lakeview. Yeah. Plenty of libraries do that. Yeah. Some even do like a full time job and then do Saturday something. So, it works out. Yeah. Yeah. It's lovely. So that's uh, on the docket for when things are settled okay. with the rest of the staff. Okay. Um, we're focused on training. Uh, Catherine and I are heading to Nila in what two weeks, <laughs> um, which is uh, up in Maine. I've got a uh, boot camp on Thursday for advocacy. Our state financial report is done, which means all the big state reporting is done. Um, if you're all good, I have a good it was, it was It's been a process, <laughs> okay. um, but we're done. I'm really, really grateful. Eva, our town count, um, sat down for like an hour with me to figure some stuff out, which was great. And I am super helpful with some random stuff that we couldn't figure out. So mm -hmm. um, very excited and it's submitted and as long as I don't hear anything, we should be good and that was a few weeks ago. So okay. good. love that. Um, Harvest Fest is coming up uh, on 26th, this is a Saturday. The friends are having their soup competition, which I'm part of, which don't eat my soup. 
Children's crafts, we have farm animals from uh, Farmer Andrew, uh, lawn games this year. Um, the touch and track will still be happening. Uh, maybe he's been coordinating with all the town departments to get uh, a bunch of different kind of trucks uh, for kids to hang out and see. Um, and then the captains are working on the literary pumpkin decorating contest. Okay. Um, if anyone else is good at making soup, I know they're still looking. Uh, for so uh, if that's something you're interested in, there's a little form at the desk. Okay, I will do that. I can, I can make soup. Thank you. <laughs> do you need? Do you know if they need particular types? I mean, do they need like vegan? Do they need just vegetarian? Unclear. There's a form, and I don't know if it has okay, information on I'll that. Okay, figure that so out. She might be able to reach out to them. Yeah, happy to do that. Cool. Um, Kitty Cat Cafe was a huge success. 29 people came. I know at least one cat. There was a family that was going to go look at him at the shelter later. So. Okay. Um, it was lovely. We had a little girl who dressed up as a cat come. Uh, we had a little girl who brought her cat um, plushy to like interact with. It was very good. It was just cute all around. Um, the sea glass succulent craft was a huge hit. Um, we've got the whale mobile coming next month, November, right? Yeah. Um, and so that's huge. And I mean that quite literally. It seems like the whole space. <laughs> um, it will also be very exciting. Um, and then uh, Nikki had the team one-up games, and it went really well. We had 15 teams, which is honestly wow. astounding. That yeah. Is, so, that's great. Yeah, yes. we're really, really excited. Definitely going to have them back again. Did um, they seem to be yes, they were very engaged. And very engaged and interested yep, in coming back? Great. Yeah, great. great. Excellent. Yeah, so we're very excited about that. Excellent. Um, that's it. And then, yeah, the job description goes up behind that. Straightforward. Um, as especially as September was a bit of decline and stuff, because everyone's going back to school and trying to get into a new thing. But we're coming back. And you found working with the town, found them to be supportive and cooperative. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. That's great. They've been helpful. We also uh, just had a meeting with the Council on Aging and are doing a lot more sharing of flyers and, and pushing each other's programs. So, okay. yeah, it's going really, really well. Yeah. yeah, they honestly, the last couple of months, town hall saved me over and over again. That's great. So. That's great. It's, we are a town department. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So, it's bottom line. Exactly. And I know you mentioned to me about the conversation with the Council on Aging. Nothing's finalized enough to even be brought up yet. Okay. All right. They, uh, I don't know what their, their plans are long term for the uh, Landing spot or destination, but you know, if they choose to do something in this area, they need to talk to us. Yeah, uh, and they know that. that. But they're because still they, there's, there's the land here. Yeah, that we own on, on not wait the town owns. Yeah. Right. Yeah, exactly. they're in like crazy beginning stages. They just want to know how we're feeling about stuff like that, which we are very positive towards. Yeah. So we'll see. It's, we need to build a town hall mm -hmm. adjacent to a new. COA center, community center, mm -hmm. connected by a port of and it needs to be located on high road. Mm -hmm. High road. Yeah. Somewhere in the 100s or 200s area. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. central location. 25 yeah. is too small. Yeah. Oh, no, absolutely. Oh, yeah, no, and, and that's their major thing is they're in a very small space. But right. yeah. and as more of that comes up, they will yeah. bring stuff to us if necessary. Okay. And if not, I, I haven't heard anything on. Anything being proposed for town hall? They're not at that point yet. No. Plus, I had a meeting with all the town managers a couple weeks ago, a month ago, time is real. Um, and yeah, they're not. They're they, they just went and entered into what another three year contract? Yeah, uh, yep, they're in a three, three year lease. Um, you mean the best? Sure. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. That's just for now. But so yes. they'll, they'll yes. figure it out. I mean, but, yeah. even if they knew where they were going. To get it through town meeting, yes. get it designed, get it yeah. built. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah. but yeah. It's okay. so we, yeah, it's okay. so we don't have any of that information just yet. You know, we're building for, for the future. Oh, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Um, absolutely. The building is proposed. Just beautiful, but too small. Too small. I mean, 500 square feet for historical no. storage. No. Two that's yeah, that's yeah. one of the things. Yeah. And one of the things that's always short. 
It's storage. Of course. Always storage. <laughs> this is, Always. This is a well, example. I yes. mean, that's traditionally in any Correct. public building I've been involved with for the past 40 years. Oh, yeah. The one thing we don't storage. build enough of is storage. Yeah. storage. Yeah. Yeah. We have, what, 14,000? Because nobody wants to pay for Oh, we have some mistakes, not about storage. Exactly right. And that's always going to be good. Yeah. Yes, sir. As long as the publishing field works. Yeah. 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 Stress. Anyway. All right. Uh, uh, that. Any comments or observations on the library statistics for the, for the month? It's, I mean, it's. Okay. Yeah, I know there's changes from. Yeah, yeah. I will say but it's more it's all, in person. But it's all positive. Yeah, absolutely. And we have some deep lines, of course, again, as September 11th. We're still seeing more people coming in the building, yeah. which is huge. Um, so and that's yes. my major yeah. thing. Look at your program activity. Oh my gosh, yeah. no. We yeah. have some amazing programs. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Catherine and Nikki have And now so that hard. you've got full staff, yes. you know, it's just, it's been this incremental building mm -hmm. process that you unfortunately been faced with since you got here. So, but yeah. you know, we're um, seven months in, and I think that we're on a good track. No, I think so. And I, I think, think that's the worst of it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> not going to win. Yes. But yes. Yes, yes. Yeah. but also it's cool that more people are coming into this building because it's so bright it during is. the winter when yes. people, you yeah. know, yep. might yep. want to get out of their houses a little bit. Yeah, absolutely. Yep. So, yeah, that's great. Yeah. And if there's a power outage, hopefully we'll have a generator by then to... That would be lovely. Yeah, the pad is in place yep. for the generator, so we mm -hmm. report that. I believe the gas line is there also, so it's just a matter of waiting for the yeah. generator. I'll ask when I see uh, James on sure. Thursday, that in the roof, because there was supposed to be awarding the contract contract for the roof replacement. And that's going to be a metal roof. Yeah. So, yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. Can you talk about removing what's up there? No, no, I haven't heard any more about that. Yeah, we, we did have that conversation with them, and they, they were trying to reassure us that we really don't have to take off what's there. Uh, the building can maintain, it can, can handle the weight. It can yeah. handle the weight. It's steel, you know, it's right there. It's about right. steel. Um, it's the question then becomes if you want to put solar panels on it yeah. after that. Yeah. Can yeah. it sustain that weight? So, so okay. Yeah. As, we go, as we go, once we get the staff in place, we, very exciting. we can start talking about so some of these other things we can have them focus on working on. I definitely don't want to hire another person for a very long time. <laughs> <laughs> Multiple times, yes. I'm pretty sure I have now officially hired for every single position. Granted, yeah. a lot of that was just shifting around, which is great, but yeah. every single position is. But no, they still had to be evaluated and assessed before they yeah, exactly. shifted. Exactly. Yeah. Well, excellent. But it's done. Excellent. And we're really happy with the staff. Like, they were already great, and now we've just grown into this really great staff. Well, I think and it's wonderful. You focus on training. Yes. Which is critical. Yep. Yep, you're, 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 what you've done, you're integrating them into the process. Yep. Yeah, so they have they have an investment. Yeah. yeah. Working on a certain binder as we speak. So. Excellent. All right. The the budget information. Yes. Okay. I tried to make this one as detailed, but two as clean as possible, <laughs> uh, which was not easy. <clears throat> But as questions, any questions you have, I will also say that having the information that I now have, we just got most of the um, appropriate numbers. I just got the most up-to-date one, um, what, like two weeks ago? Mm -hmm. um, so there's some changes I would probably be making, um, like the children's budget, because we have so many of these funds that are children-specific, mm -hmm. and probably going to shift, shift over there. And start taking from this. Yep, that's okay. our plan. Good. And we've determined that the, the NAID money has been utilized. Yes, yep. Okay. And in essence, it was used for the archivist? Yep, so it was used for the archivist. It was used for um, art stuff, for the... Um, These displays for the Yes. Um, and then... Um, the generator. Yes. 25000 was going to the generator. Yep. Yeah. Okay. okay, so that's been utilized. It's exhausting. It's exhausting. Yeah. Okay. Yep. But 
And these are all of the various accounts that we have. Yes. The um, uh, what was her account? The tech fund. Yeah. Uh, I did not put that in here because my brain associates it with a friend. Because right, 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 right. Okay. Right, but we have, do you have a sense of how much is in that? Not a heck of a lot, okay. um, but still something. Let me see if it's in my phone. Oh, so, I guess we've been using it. Okay. Oh, yes. Yeah. You we've been, been okay, using so. it for most of our, like, um, some of our database stuff. Um, we're using it for our um, statistics tracking software. Uh, okay. Yes, but we have, we've been using that one. I think that's probably one of the very few that we have actually. Does the town invest in these funds? Yes. Yeah. yeah. So the funds are invested. Yeah. So they, they are generating some. Some. some yes. Yeah. Sure and they are. Right. Yes. Right. They are growing. Yeah. Right. Even one of them jumped like, almost a couple hundred dollars. Mm -hmm. Take it and give it to the town to. And I think I think we at that time made the decision to put it with the friends. Right. Because Maureen yeah. is doing such a great job. Yeah. And I'm also Pam's doing a wonderful job. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. She updates awesome. each month. I will have those numbers for you next time. I didn't yeah. 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 No, and I I miss that Utilizing it for the purpose. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. That, that's all yeah. that matters. I, I know all that matters, but I Yeah, for a place that two years or bought children's homes okay. last year. Yeah. That would make Lois very, very happy. Yeah, it's definitely going to be for all kinds of fun tech yeah. stuff. Yeah. yeah. When did that start? I don't know. Well, you know, I found, I found a program from her um, funeral service. It's going to be 12, 14 years. It's been a long time. Longer when, than I thought. That's when I came on the board because yeah. I filled her a position. Yeah, uh, I forgot about that. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I did until just now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, you want to fill this, the, the balance of this position? Sure, okay. Okay, like the rest of you. <laughs> Well, oh, this is good. What do we contemplate within this databases entry here? Mm -hmm. What does that include? Sure. So it includes, it includes like we have um, universal class that gets used by the public. Ancestry gets put into that. Uh, Mangled languages gets put into that. So mostly it's the stuff that goes. If you go on our website and you're in like the database section, mm -hmm. all of those for the most part come out of that. Um, oh, uh, the Heritage the Historical Society one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that comes through that as well. Uh, but basically, I was just watching one of their things last night. Yeah, exactly. Basically, yeah. any kind of database that comes through that the patrons use, mm -hmm. that's what that is. So these items here that are under. Databases, yes. statistics, yes. Absolutely. Yes. those things. Yes. <coughs> those are recurring yes. subscriptions. Yes. Yeah. Most of them are yearly, but some of them, like Canopy, um, Hoopla, yeah. both of those are, are monthly. And it's based off of usage. Usage. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. So the, the invoice show is yeah. yeah, set it up and 
Dick Sands on it. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I was just curious. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So, if there are any questions you have? No, this this uh, level of detail is great. I tried to. I tried. <laughs> yeah. I also asked Catherine like six hundred times this is legible, so to thank her for any oh. readability there. <laughs> Completely. Yeah. If you could enter under the municipal municipal <laughs> expenses breakdown, mm -hmm. the totals column, much as you don't. Sure. Yeah, that would have been helpful. Well, it, it is. Um, it totals out to the municipal expenses here. At 114. Right. But I can do that for the available and extended fix of that. Mm -hmm. yeah, absolutely. Just wondering. Yeah, of course. That makes sense. It should. <laughs> it, yeah. it should. Not because it's double entry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it does if you just glance through it. Yeah. Easy. Okay. So, yeah so I was just wondering. Yeah. That's superb. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 killer, no doubt. Yeah. Yeah, the budget is always the thing that scares me most. So anything no, that I can get a, a handle on it, and I actually will say making this help me as well. So. Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah. Good. But a lot of this, a lot of the funds that we have, which are amazing, are children specific, which is mm. the thing um, that they can't just be used more generally, which is fine. Um, so we'll just kind of allocate children stuff there and. Yeah. Move that stuff out so there. the monies that we're getting from the friends for children's programming. It's just the programming. Program. Okay. Yeah. So if some of these funds can be used for that purpose, yes, most maybe of the money we get from the friends could be. Yeah, they would love that, but most of the materials. Material. Yeah. 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 There's the specific for children's print materials and one specific for children's media. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. and then one for children room. Which. Uh, we can use a little bit of um, to get new little sign holder things okay. to tell you what letter it's okay. in. Um, okay, so like it's that. good for the children's room. Yes. yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. That, that, it just makes sense. Yeah. It's there. We need. Exactly. So my yeah. plan is to move that over. We've also been kind of, I mean, granted, the MDLC membership comes out of library supplies, so it always looks way worse than it is. Mm -hmm. right. But mm -hmm. we have been expanding. Like we got new carts. Um, and we just have to get label maker, uh, label, not label, same label, laminator, cleaner paper, and stuff like that. So those supplies have kind of gone up in what we need, which is fine. Um, so I'm probably going to move some of the children's print specifically because that has a bigger uh, budget. Oh, sorry. No, up. do we still have an expectation from MB? They'll see that a certain percentage of the overall allocation. Yeah. Yep. So all of that municipal express uh, expenses breakdown, mm -hmm. that's the stuff that like goes into our uh, making our 18, 19 percent rather. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. So and that's uh, along with the building maintenance money. Yes. Yep. Okay. Even though James has control over it. James has full control over it. I'm yep. trying to keep an updated idea of it because I know last year we were tight mm -hmm. and I had clearly obviously no idea about that, partly because I was doing the part and because we weren't tracking it. Okay. Um, when we get the municipal report, it gives you kind of a breakdown, but I'm, I've been taking those and putting it into the budget just for now okay. um, to kind of know where we're putting it to because for a while they were sent, we were sending them. We Yeah. Well, that's the opportunity now that, like you said, now that you get your staff in yes. place and you start thinking about yeah. mm -hmm. what to do going forward. Yep. Um, and then I, the sky. Yeah, yep. no, it is, absolutely. Yeah, I've got a list going, and my hope is at our, so we're going to have staff meetings again, that workflow staff, mm -hmm. starting in November. Um, hopefully, Good. and we're going to have staff meetings again, starting in November. Hopefully, and my hope is to start getting everyone's dreams. Mm -hmm. And I have some people, like I sat down and had those conversations with a couple of people, but. I want everyone's big dreams for themselves, for the department, for the library, and those dreams will be given. Yeah, and if you know, if you know if what's going on in some other libraries and they're yep. having success with it. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, like Tuxbury, I mean, they, they, they're, they're his 
online stuff, his Zoom stuff. Is yeah. Like if, and I know we're connecting yeah. with him, so that, you know, it's just. Yeah, we're learning I don't know how he does it, but. Yeah. <laughs> He's making him in the life and he's amazing, but in a very just, continued way. I, I love his <laughs> Zomchia traveling stuff. Oh, he's he's so fun. Fun. Yeah. But yeah, so. Especially the fellow that was in Wakefield before. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 He does a lot of traveling and does, did a thing on photography, mm -hmm. uh, you know, how he takes his pictures while he's traveling. Because yeah. every time I, I watch him, there's never any people in his picture. Not all, I'd say 95% of the time. And he said, that's intentional. I wait yeah. and I, I want that structure or that scenery or that whatever. I really don't want the people in it. So I wait wow. and it's just, yeah. you know, it's, it's yeah, and Kevin has chosen some great ones of theirs to, to hook into, yep. which is like wonderful. Yep. We actually just rescheduled the Boston Lighthouse. Oh, okay. Uh, good. Lake Keeper. Uh, they were able to rescheduled it from March. Okay. Good, good. I don't good. Know, that. Okay. But, yeah. Yeah, right. she's doing an amazing adult program. Yeah, uh, and her brother's program. I know. That was yeah. fantastic. You know, he, uh, he was a speechwriter for him. Oh, Robert, and then we watched the, the, the JFK. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it that was, was great. Fantastic. Yeah, it yeah. was great. I read the review of the book. It, yeah. was, it was very good. And he yes. had people who he had interviewed to write the book who were there as participants and just mm -hmm. their experiences about speaking publicly. And you know, it was just yeah. great stuff. Good stuff. So, okay. oh. we're, we're doing well. We're yeah. Happy with where we're at right now. Yeah. Just in general. Good. Good. Just, you know, just do what we can to keep everybody in place as long as we can. Yes. yes. As we've talked about, we are have always been a revolving door. And I expect, yeah. I always expect part-time positions in particular to continue to do that. Just Absolutely. Just your landing spot for new grads and yep. that kind of thing. Yep. That's great. And I want people to learn and work great with that. Absolutely. So I expect yeah. those to kind of continue working. I am hoping for at least a year on each of those. Yeah. And I'm hoping everyone else is safe. I feel pretty confident that they feel more supportive. You know, it's a nice environment to work in. It's great. Mm -hmm. So, thank you. Good job. Beauty. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Any other old business? Any other new business? Uh, a day for another meeting? While you're setting that, I need to go get my book. Okay. okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, second Tuesday, November is the 12th. Okay. Check. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Just make sure that there's nothing happening. Oh, okay. still be Ooh. All right, November 12th, sounds great. I'm sorry, I just missed it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. Hi. Okay, November 12th. November 12th. Yes. Okay. <coughs> okay, well, since there's three of us, we can make a motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. Okay. okay. All we right. got it. <laughs>